one of these. This is Venom Racing. Welcome to Cars and Coffee. Perfect. Sometimes not good. <laughs> You need to tell that to McLaren, look at them. <laughs> yeah, you can't get, no, can't get no manual here, but no. you gotta admit though, the inside of these McLarens is it's so nice, especially with like the waterfall center console. It's a spaceship in there. Pretty much, yeah. I've been watching Narcos, I've been watching Pablo Escobar and how he does his business. So. Well, I mean the thing is, we can't tell everyone how we make our money, so we're gonna have to go and just cut this part out of it. I think the next thing I'll probably end up buying, I, I don't know, next next car I really want to change. Aston Martin. <laughs> Especially Miami Blue. John, there's just something like three cars right here. I feel so like one is... I really feel like we're just playing Among Us right now, because obviously there's a lot of Ferraris here at the show, but there's really just one imposter here, but I'm not sure which one it is. Can you guys tell me? No, I don't know. Like one All mid-engine, like so I, don't, I can't tell. <laughs> Family friends. Uh, John, have you seen the new Pontiac Aztec since they redid it over here? I think Walter White, I don't think he'd be able to get away with as much as he did back in uh <laughs> Yeah, no joke. The police would catch on to him a lot sooner than they did. That's Maybe they might not be able to catch him though. Yeah, these things are pure luxury now. I might have to get myself a Pontiac Aztec. Pontiac's really stepping up the game. <laughs> are they even around anymore? No. <laughs> that is so sick, yeah. They literally put the engines in here. I think this is like Chevy's first rear engine car that they ever actually made back in like the 60s. Weren't these uh, called unsafe at any speed? <laughs> yeah, pretty much, but they were well worth it. <laughs> on the inside, it looked really clean. I think the old shit handle is kind of funny. This is, uh, this is plastic here. It's, I remember I, uh, he posted about this on the Facebook page whenever he had done this. This is actually a completely plastic <laughs> car. It actually does not look bad at all. Yeah. He, had, he had bought their like $500 like auto car system. Plasti of the whole thing, and I remember seeing this, and this is kind of what got me interested in Plasti. It looks really decent. It actually, does look for really good. Really cheap project cars. It's not a bad idea. Probably a lot easier than having the Rapid. Yeah, it actually really is. You, even have, you can even yeah. drag something behind you. See? I'm a huge fan of these engines because, for a fact, if you put this insane cam in it, it literally sounds like someone just banging on a door. It's the nastiest cam I've ever heard of. We'll, input, we'll put it here. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. oh. I like the 992s. I, 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 I like the 992s, how they have the front end, like the headlights have the four little LED squares and stuff. Yeah, they look good. My favorite's still the uh, V6. Dude, okay. This is an R33 GTR. And. Electricity alone. Looks to me like it's an RB25 and not an RB26. It could actually be an RB26 with an RB25 head, but nonetheless, it's an RB, and RBs are freaking cool. I kind of miss my RB20. RB20 is fun. They were talking get this real quick. One of uh, Fabrication is one of our buddies, uh, Andy Dennington. We'll make sure to put his link to his business down in the description below. He makes all these cool custom pieces for any R33 and super parts. Uh, the amount of cars that are here is so much more than it used to be. We used to be at a much smaller uh, parking complex. This location is much bigger. It's at least five times the size and it's completely full. It's awesome. It's cool to see this kind of growth in the car community. It really is. John always gets excited when he hears five times the size. You know what? Since, since I'm done with school, guys, I think I'm just going to buy one of these and just... I don't Traveling know. Traveling country. Yeah, I think just go across country. And uh, see, Dog is my co-pilot. I already got Ava in the back. <laughs> 
She might run away if I leave the door open. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been looking at lately that I ripped off with like uh, a picture from Eight Hundred Feet Underground too. Oh, this one's a background car in Too Fast Too Furious. Oh no, oh, shit. Really? Really? In Miami, it's like two weeks ago. That is actually badass. So this was in Too Fast Too Furious. I got into a car. I was like, <laughs> yeah, so I love this car so much. It's so fun. All right. So I have a serious question, Zach. Yeah. Has Ludacris sit in this car because it's too fast or furious? You know, he's performing at UCO in a few weeks, so you should get you set that up. <laughs> there you go, make it happen. <laughs> that is so cool, though. And you can just play that in the subsystem. There Let's be real. Go. 480 watts, <laughs> 600 watts actually. I thought I had a plan. Like a Ferrari membership thing. Man, look at this ricer over here, John. <laughs> I mean, if you talk to the owner, he, he knows it makes a lot of rice out of that thing. Mm. Wait. Two quarts a gallon. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Two quarts a gallon. What are you taking me for a ride in it? Want to set it up? I want to fucking die in it. It looks so fun. I kinda, I'm kind of curious to see what the turbo feels like compared to supercharger. Do you like it better? Just the fact that it makes a lot more power. Yeah. yeah. So, Tyler, tell the people on the channel what the power delivery is like It's compared to the supercharger. Well, the supercharger, I mean, it was kind of, you know, it, was, it wasn't what you think. It's not like a twin screw where you floor it and you automatically had all the power. You still had to get, it's very linear to the power band like normal. This one, it's nothing and then it spools and then it's all there. It nice. goes from 200 horsepower to probably six or seven in a matter of seconds. Wow! And if you're not holding on to it, it, it will catch. It'll get you by surprise. It'll bite you in the ass. Yeah, it's it's fun. That looks awesome. So uh, in terms of like, so what we have here is a uh, a stack of magazines. This was made by a uh, car club here, BMW Car Club. <laughs> so uh, obviously this is a uh, what some people refer to as the clown shoe. It's the shooting brake. Uh, this is the M coupe, right? I think it's or they call it the M. God, what do they end up calling this thing? I, I think they call it the M Coupe, The ZM. Right? The that ZM, might be I think it, it actually. Oh my god, Becky. But these are relatively rare, actually. I really like how they actually had analog gauges right there, right yes. by the shifters. It looks really good. It looks really good. The car looks really good, honestly, as a whole. And I mean, it's such a unique design. You don't see these from them anymore. This has Elon Musk shaking in his boots right here. All right, and this really is such a clever design. I mean, so I'm selling my Tesla stocks. Yeah, I think you need to. You need to sell those stocks and buy one of these. Dude, that is insane. Think, Zach? This is incredible. So obviously, there's a story here to go with it, but these things just in general are so hard to find clean anymore. I mean, it's a gorgeous car. It really is. It's amazing. I love these. I'm sorry? My car's not restored. The paint job is half as old. The paint job's 27 years. Okay. But uh, its original wheels, chrome, and full street. That's remarkable. I, I mean, to find one, it's totally original. <laughs> you better find it off a needle in a haystack. That it's original amazing. owner. Yeah, that's uh, right, and that's amazing. That's. Uh... <laughs>
Perfect. Check. What, what is that noise? No, no, it's not in here. What is that? What, what's, what is that? What is that? Oh, uh, it, the, the steering angle, it's so huge. It's hey, what the fuck? Oh, oh yeah. shit, that's good. Oh, my God. Uh, yes, that angle. Ava, what is that? Ava, Ava, come here. Come here, what is that? Is that a demon? Oh, this one's terrible. What is this? Uh... <laughs> that's the YouTube button. <laughs> <laughs> no one's gonna hit the subscribe button to that. It's close enough. <laughs>